YouTube, what's good? YouTube, what is going on? What is happening? All right, it's your guy one more time, Desiree L. Higgs Jr. And of course, I'm back with another fragrance video. All right, so to my smell good family, what's going on, y'all? Hopefully, y'all are well. Hopefully, y'all are good. Hopefully, y'all are fantastic. Positive energy, positive vibes. Y'all know how we give it up here on this channel, okay? So um, I'm back at it today with another cheapy video. Um, around this time of year, and it was like this last year as well, but around this time of year, we're inching closer to the holidays. The weather is changing. And I know for me, when I first really started going crazy with my fragrance collection, I found a lot of great cheapies for cold, cooler and colder weather, man. It was, I was on a fantastic run, man. So I'm always getting asked, you know, some uh, uh, recommendations uh, for certain price ranges. And, you know, I always keep try to keep that in mind when we're rolling out, this, uh, rolling out these videos. Um, so a couple of weeks ago we did, uh, I think my, my top 10 cheapies for the fall 2022. And now I'm back with seven more cheapies, uh, that you could look into. All of these are $30 and below. One of them might be like a little over 30, $35. It just depends on where you're looking, but all seven of these are, have great prices. They're readily available. You can grab them right now. All right. And I promise y'all, I'm going to start doing a better job of putting the links of the fragrances in the description so you guys can go ahead and uh, uh, make a purchase if you're trying to do so right then and there. So I, I'm, work, I'm working on me. I'm working on me. Don't judge me. I'm working on me, all right? So I'm going I'm to I'm get to doing that for you guys for sure, all right? So let's go ahead and get right into the video. Seven more fall cheapy fragrances for 2022. All right, up first... From the house of Vince Komuto. All right, we have Terra Extreme. Terra Extreme. Now, I ran this one last uh, fall and winter. I ran this one, man. Um, this stuff is really good. It's really, really good. It's kind of like a, 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 a second cousin of like Versace Eros. That's what it is. So follow me. So you, you, you do get a Versace Eros vibe, but... It's a, a boozy component. You have some rum in this fragrance, some cinnamon. Uh, I believe there's some uh, orange in here, uh, some ambroxan in here down in the base. It's a very, uh, it's a very nice, very nice scent for the fall. You can get this for around twenty-five to thirty dollars on discounters, man. So it has pretty good longevity, could pretty good performance. I get about that right at that seven-hour mark. If you spray yourself a little more, you could probably extend that. But um, I'm gonna have a spray anywhere. And this is a, uh, I think it's an EDP. Yeah, this is an EDP concentration, all right? And you kind of sense that it has some depth and it has some uh, 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 some body to it as well. Sweet, boozy uh, uh, fragrance. Um, and it's like a long distant cousin of Versace Aero. So look into this one on discounters. It's a very good one to have. Uh, for this time of year for sure. So from the house of Vince Camuto, we have Terra Extreme. Terra Extreme. All right, up next, this is probably a cheapy Hall of Famer by now. It should be if it is not. This stuff swept through the fragrance community. No matter if you're in the niches or EDTs or other colognes, it don't matter. This one made waves. From the house of Cremo, all right, we have Spice and Black Vanilla. Spice and black vanilla. This one right here, uh, it's still running wild. Wow, it, but this would be twenty dollars, nineteen ninety nine, twenty dollars. It's crazy. All right, you get that spicy, sweet vanilla, uh, peppery type of fragrance, man. A lot of people say it's close to uh, uh, what is it, Spice Bomb Extreme. I know, I know, it is similarities there. This is sweeter than that. Um, but this stuff is good. It performs really, really well as well. Even though it's an EDT, I get about seven hours. I get about seven hours wearing this stuff right here. You get this from Walmart, Target, Amazon, 19 to $22. It just depends on where you're, uh, you're shopping at. But this is definitely, th this would probably be the one I would tell you to go get. If you're looking for something to hold you down and that smells really nice, has a quality to it, 
and 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 and, and it would make someone want to turn their head and ask you what is that that you have on go to walmart get in your car right now go to walmart get in your car right now and go to walmart and get you a bottle of this stuff spice and black vanilla is a cheapy hall of famer no doubt about it go ahead and get this one man this is great for this time of year spice black and vanilla by criminal all right, next up from the House of Azaro. Man, I really love this stuff. From the House of Azaro, Azaro we have Azaro Nighttime. All right, Azaro Nighttime. This is very, very, very sexy. <laughs> it's very, very sexy. Nighttime scent. You get a little rhubarb in here, a little citrus in here as well. A hint of green. It kind of comes off like a little, uh, like a fougere. Kind of got this slight, high quality, like shaving cream. Uh, uh, note, uh, not note, but like, I guess a chord, a vibe when you first spray it. But as it settles down, man, you get this slightly spicy. Well, not, it is spicy. Spicy. Uh, rhubarb -y, citrusy, uh, slight green fragrance, man, and it's sexy, man. This one leans towards the more uh, masculine man, uh, the more masculine man who's looking for that masculine scent, but with a twist that you know to add a uh, take the edge off, so to speak. This is the one to look into. Now, I got this from my local Burlington for $16. $16.99, I got it from my local Burlington. So look in your discounters, but then you can get this for a decent price online as well. This stuff is fantastic. From the house of Azaro, we have Azaro Nighttime. Nighttime. All right, up next, man, from the house of Roberto uh, Cavalli, we have one more. One more. Now, this one has just started to grow on me, man, and I'm going to be... Ooh, really putting this one to the test for sure. Really putting this one to the test this upcoming uh, fall and winter. You get this honey and this violet leaf uh, dance that's really going on. They're just sharing the dance floor back and forth, back and forth. But this stuff is nice. has really good quality. Um, the performance on this thing is decent. I get about six to seven hours of performance on this. Of course, you can overspray and kind of extend that if you would like. Um, but this is a very... Uh, nice fragrance for this time of year. I got this for twenty-five dollars off Fragrance Net last year. I'm not really sure what the price is right now, but that's what I paid. But I'll have it down below in the description. This stuff is sexy, man. Man, it's sexy, man. And for what you pay and what you get, man, it's it's it's, it's criminal. It's criminal, man. But this stuff is fantastic. From the house of Roberto Cavalli. All right, we got one more. Really like this stuff, man. Really like it. All right, all right. Up next from the house of Bath and Body Works, we did a, 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 a first impression on this not too long ago. We have coffee and whiskey, coffee and whiskey. Now this is another one that has caught fire <laughs> out in the fragrance world, and uh, for rightfully so. For what you pay around that thirty dollar mark, you definitely get coffee, whiskey with some vanilla in here as well, um, and that's it. Coffee, whiskey, and vanilla, if you're into that vibe, um, this is for you, for sure. You're paying a decent price for it. Now, I'm not really sure what the concentration of this thing is because it doesn't state uh, what it is, but if I had to guess, it's probably EDT uh, concentration, 3.4 ounce, 100 mLs, and this stuff is really nice. Um, this is something if you're gonna be going out um, in the evening time and you're just chilling, man, you and, you and your significant other might be going to get a, a dessert or maybe even a late night uh, drink or something like that and it's cooler out. This is one right here that could really uh, show out for you and really pay dividends. So you're not paying that much for it either and that's a plus. From the House of Bath and Body Works, we have coffee and whiskey. Coffee and whiskey. This stuff is really, really good. All right. Up next, whoo, this stuff is really good. I got a video coming out on this one really, really soon, but man, 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 I really like this stuff. From the house of our moth, we have Odyssey Home. Odyssey Home. This stuff is great, bro. This stuff, oh, is great, man. You get this, uh, the spicy vanilla, this this oriental vibe up top, and then it's accompanied by some iris, man. And what it reminds me of, it reminds me of several iris fragrances that I love, like Valentino's Womo and 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 Givenchy uh, EDP and uh, 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 
uh, Blue Noir Parfum. I mean, it's just a lot of different iris-based fragrances in one. That's what you get with this one, man. And um, it is really nice. It smells really good. Decent quality. I'm not going to lie. You do get this synthetic vibe when you the first initial blast. But once that starts to die down, man, listen. Like, this stuff is really good. And you get it for a great price, $30 or below. I got mine off Amazon.com. I think from the internal ooze store for like $26.99. This stuff is really good. I like it a lot, man. Um, this is gonna be a prime cheapie uh, for sure if people can get their hands on it. So if you are into the Valentino Womo uh, Givenchy Gentleman EDP style of fragrances, then you're gonna like this one for sure. This is good, good stuff, man. From the house of our moth, we have Odyssey Own, oh, man. EDP concentration on that for sure. All right, and last but not least, if you're trying to save you a couple of dollars and you love perfumes de Marley Layton, well, man, I can't tell you. Well, I am telling you, you need to get this right now if you can. I'm late to the party. Don't you be even later. From the house of Al Haramain, we have Detour Noir. Detour Noir. This stuff is $30 or less. Fragrance.ca. Perfumes de Marley Layton for sure. Good quality, great price, good performance. You can't beat it, man. If you are in just wanting to smell or have Parfums de Marlin, you just aren't ready to spend that amount of money that it costs to get Parfums de Marlin Layton, which is really expensive, then go this way. And I promise you, you will be satisfied. You will be satisfied having this for sure. So Layton is an excellent fragrance, an excellent scent for the fall and for the winter. I personally adore it and it is really, really good, man. So check this one out for $30 or less. Al Haramain's Detour Noir. Detour Noir. All right, guys, that is seven more, seven more fall cheapies that you can look into. You can get your hands on today. Um, all of these are like $31, $32 or below. You can save you some money and smell fantastic. Sometimes we get lost in the, I ain't gonna speak for everybody, but sometimes even myself, you get lost in, you know, the art of this thing when it comes to the prices and this and that, man. And when I smell these fragrances, it just kind of full circles me and recenters me, man, when it comes back because it doesn't matter how much you pay. It doesn't matter the brand that you're wearing. You could spend 20 bucks to $500 and everybody's still smelling great. Everybody smells still smelling fantastic. And that's the truth, man. So um, I'm glad to be reminded when I go to my collection and I smell these great fragrances, man, that were produced for you uh, for little to no money. Well, it's not no money, but little money. Let's keep it there, little money, all right? So um, if you would like to be the next member of the Smell Good family, all you gotta do is subscribe to the channel, like the video, meet me in the comments. We can talk about what you love and what I love, and that is the art of fragrance, okay? So you guys be cool, take care of yourselves, splacker down, splacker up, put that juice on, represent yourself, man. Represent yourself. And when you come through, when you come through, oh yeah, they gonna know it was you, for sure. Y'all be cool, man.